Hi everyone, this is Tansett 2019 MBA question paper order video solution. It's a data sufficiency question, easy question. One logical reasoning puzzle, one simple puzzle. That is DS format. Let's get started with the question. Example in the KVM, you can go to the KVM. This is a must solve question. You can solve and answer correct. Let's get started. What's the question? How many children are there between J and K in a row of children? One row of children is there. J and K are in the same way. How many students are there? How many children are there? That's why. Let's look at the statements in a while. Let's look at the four answer options. What are they? A, B, C, D, N, N. Either one or two is sufficient. One thaniya sufficient, two thaniya sufficient, rendu me thani thaniya sufficient are there. We'll go with A as the answer. Both one and two are sufficient. Rendu setta are sufficient. One and rendu setta. Both one and two are required to answer the question. Apdi irinda are there. Answer option will be B. One alone is sufficient while two is not. Apdi na C. Two alone is sufficient, one is not. Then the answer option is D. So, we've understood what these four answer options mean. Get started by looking at what the question is. J kum K kum nado le, yathna children dhir kaanga abhi nga. Enna answer kudu poon, J kum K kum nado le, nal children dhir kaanga, padinit children dhir kaanga. You are going to come up with a number. J inga irik kaare, K inga irik kaare, K inga irik kaare, J inga irik kaare. Rindu verik nado le, yathna children dhir kaanga abhi nga, oor number a answer a kudu kapoon. If the answer to the question is a number, then the data yappa sufficient a rukoon, when we have a unique value. In the rindu verik nado le, Three children are correct. Three children are correct. One answer is correct. If you say three or three or three, then the data is not sufficient. We need to come up with one single answer. With this, let's get started by evaluating the statements. We'll look at statement one alone. One alone, what do you say? J is 15th from the left in the row. So, left in the row, count one, two, three, that's what you say. 15th place, J is correct. K pati in the statement, there is no data. So, statement one alone is definitely not sufficient. One is sufficient, why don't we eliminate it? One alone is sufficient, two is not definite, why don't we eliminate it? Either one or two, this is how it is. One is sufficient, two is sufficient, then we will go with A. Otherwise, we are going to eliminate A also. So, look at statement two alone. Otherwise, we will be able to decide whether two alone is sufficient or D. If we combine it, we will be sufficient to B. Look at statement two alone. Again, note this. We are going to be looking at two alone. We will not look at one at all. Question is, J and K are how many children are there? What do you say? K is exactly in the middle. So, K is where it is, that is the middle position. And there are 10 children towards this, right? So, K is where it is, 10 children are there in that role. So, if you are there, 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 you are there. So, K is left, you are there. So, K is left, you are there in the position. K is in the 11th position. That is the same. J is the position in the statement. You know the statement. Pohon statement lalu ni, nama we are evaluating only statement two right now. So two aje, J patenya information ni illah anala. Two alone is also not sufficient. Two is not sufficient. Ia kerana dua option ni, nama eliminate punya aje. D can also be eliminated. It says two alone is sufficient. Dua taninya sufficient illah, anala D also can be eliminated. So itu ada exam ni, ni mudah tu pointer ikla. Answer option B ni mark punya. If a learning model ikra anala, we'll just combine and see whether we are able to get a unique answer. Let quick kaya ikapola. K ada position eleven from the left. First statement lalu patah na. J out of position, where are you going to go? J out of position, 15th from the left. So, left is going to be two out of position. We are going to combine two statements. So, 1 is going to be 15th place, there is J. 1 is going to be 11th position, there is K. So, J and K are going to be 12, 13, 14. There are three children in between J and K in this row of children. We have been able to come up with a unique answer combining the two statements. Statements together are sufficient. For answer option B is the correct answer to the question.